Hi guys, it's Mika again. Today we'll be talking about two new Huawei devices, the Nova 12i and the Nova 12se. You might have reservations about getting yourself a Huawei device due to the absence of Google services and limited access to other essential apps. But that's about to change with the Nova 12 series. That's not all. You get fashion-forward design matched with cool new features including the 108 megapixel main camera and EMUI 14. Let's dive in and see which Nova is the one for you. Let's start with the aesthetics. We have both in black colorway and surprisingly even with such minimalist designs, they're able to keep the wow factor because of their elegance. If you want a more vibrant option, you can go for the green colorway. For the Nova 12 SE, we have a boxy frame with smooth edges as well as a slim and lightweight profile making it easy yet comfortable to grip even for long hours. It already looks elegant, but more so with the golden accents found at the star orbit rings in the Huawei Nova logo. It's even satisfying to touch because of its silky matte finish. Meanwhile, the Nova 12i has a more curved body for a sleek look. It measures 8.4mm and weighs 199g. Good thing is, it feels lighter than it actually is. The design looks quite familiar because it's a Mate series look-alike with a silver accent on the camera layout. It also has a subtle Huawei logo to add a premium touch. Next up is the display. On both devices, a large, vivid screen will greet you up front. The Nova 12 SE features a 6.67-inch OLED display with 91.85% screen-to-body ratio. It also has an always-on display functionality that conveniently shows real-time updates. The visuals are stunning and colors are true to life. You'll appreciate this more when you watch animated films like Spider-Verse for example. It also has a 270Hz touch sampling rate which gives you smooth swipes and scrolls. The Nova 12i on the other hand has a larger 6.7-inch Full HD always-on display with 94.15% screen-to-body ratio. The large display with slim bezels makes it a great companion to binge-watch series and doom-scroll on Instagram or TikTok. It also has a smooth dimming control to protect your eyes by adjusting screen brightness according to your environment. As stylish as these panels look, it's even better to know that they can do the job well. It's capable of capturing high-quality shots in different lighting scenarios. First, we have a triple camera setup for the Nova 12 SE. This includes a 108MP main camera, 8MP ultra-wide camera, and 2MP macro camera. Across various lighting scenarios, the Nova 12 SE didn't disappoint. Natural lighting was my best friend. Snaps of my favorite cafes look detailed and pretty. But as for shooting in low light, you already need stable hands to get good quality shots and to reduce image noise. You'll thank yourself after. If you're a selfie queen, you'll definitely love the 32 megapixel front camera. All selfies I took came out clear and vibrant. Lighting isn't even an issue. Meanwhile, the Nova 12i has a dual camera setup featuring a 108 megapixel main camera and 2 megapixel in depth camera. I tried shooting outdoors and indoors, and the results were amazing. In good lighting, it produces crisp and clear images. Colors appear natural as well, not too vibrant nor washed out. It's easy to play around and take beautiful aesthetic shots. Good news! Quality of shots taken in low light didn't take a major hit. In fact, they look bright and decent enough to post on social media, even without edits. Lastly, you have the 8 megapixel selfie camera, which wasn't bad either across different lighting scenarios. In terms of performance, both delivered quite well. They're built with a Qualcomm Snapdragon 680 processor, which handles light to moderate tasks effortlessly. Both come with an 8 plus 256 gig configuration. This pair is not too bad for most users, and will be more than enough for multitasking and storing content. Let me give you guys another good combination. Large battery and fast charging capabilities. And thankfully, that's what you get from the Nova 12 series. The Nova 12 SE comes with 4,500 mAh battery with 66 watt Huawei supercharged turbo. While the Nova 12i is packed with 5,000 mAh battery with 44 watt Huawei supercharged turbo. Both devices run Huawei's EMUI 14, which if you're gonna ask me is something Gen Z and millennials can look forward to. 
It adds so much fun through new lock screen themes that can be personalized. There's a poster, headline, and emojis. My personal favorite is the poster. You can choose photos from your gallery, customize the font, layout, and template color. The emoji theme is so adorable. You can choose up to six emojis as well as change the icon colors. I've always been a fan of how neat and intuitive Huawei's interface is, and it just keeps getting better. Next up is the service widgets which are larger than app icons and display all the information users need. Simply swipe up to generate the service widget. You can even combine several to create a combo of your essential apps. Then of course, there's the Superhub 2.0. This makes sharing content between applications much easier. Select some images and drag them to the Superhub. Afterwards, open the screen where you're editing, then drag all content out. So convenient, right? Another game-changing update on the Nova 12 series is the easy access to Google Apps and other popular apps through App Gallery. That's right, you don't have to go through a lot just to download apps like Gmail and Google Maps. It's great because these are apps we can't live without. So that's the Nova 12 series for you. The verdict? We asked while we listen. At the end of the day, that's all that matters. And we can only expect it to get better from here. Props to Huawei for putting in the work to make essential apps more accessible. We've always been a fan of Huawei's design, camera capabilities, smart features, and performance. Perhaps we can add another to the list? This leaves us with a question, which Nova is the one for you? If you live a fast-paced lifestyle, love creating content, and value portability, go for the Nova 12 SE. But if you love viewing content as much as creating them and are looking for everyday dependability, the Nova 12i is a solid choice. Here are the prices for the Nova 12i and the Nova 12 SE. And that wraps it up. Let us know what you guys think of the new Nova 12 series. Hope you guys like this video. See you in the next one.